In evolutionary terms, our amygdala is one of the oldest parts of our brain, and we share it with most other living beings. And one of its important roles is to make us react very quickly to serious physical danger. So a wonderful example that most people can relate to with regard to how the amygdala works is if you are walking on a path and out of the corner of your eye you see something and you think it might be a snake and you jump. Now you have jumped, you have had an autonomic nervous system response probably before it's even registered that it might be a snake. Your jumping is immediate. So the sensory information comes in and the amygdala has you react very, very quickly. Now, in that example with the possible snake, you probably pause, take a second look. You see it's just a stick and you can calm down. But that activation might remain for a little while. You might be feeling on edge, even though you know, hmm, just a stick. But if that actually was a snake and you live in an area with dangerous snakes, you would want to react that fast. So your brain is designed to keep you safe. So in that moment, when you spot a potential danger, your body reacts before it's confirmed, before the danger is confirmed. The information that gets to your frontal lobe that processes whether it's actually a danger or not takes a little bit more time. So the amygdala operates sort of on an unconscious level. Like in that example with the possible snake that ends up being a stick, the amygdala has a better safe than sorry attitude. Better to keep you safe than to be sorry later. 